didn't expect to find you in here. I needed a drink. I think we should, uh, we should have a little talk. But if this is about the money, I don't need it anymore. So I hear. What? I know everything. You do? And if this is true, you should feel deeply ashamed of yourself. You are selling your baby. I'm offering to be a surrogate. It's perfectly legal. And you would have sold your other baby if you hadn't lost it. It's not as simple as that. And we needed the money. What could you possibly be so desperate for thousands of pounds for that you would sell a baby? It's nothing to do with you. Yes, it does. Just because you're over 18, it doesn't mean I stop having responsibilities. I am old enough to make my own decisions. Like when you decided to lie to me and Paul and Todd about the abortion and then try and con money out of us. I'm sorry about that, but I was desperate. I knew there was something wrong. And I asked you if you needed help. <laughs> you wouldn't have understood. You're right. Maybe I wouldn't. But this madness needs to stop now before you throw your whole life away. You're overreacting, Billy. Maybe. But I promised your dad that I would take care of you. I'm going to go and speak to Mike and Esther. I'm going to tell them it's over. Will you stop treating me like I'm a kid? I'm a grown-up, a woman, so if I want to do this, I can. OK, I get it. But we have to discuss it first. No, no, we don't. You're not listening. I am not talking about this with you or anyone else. Now, if you don't mind, I'm going to go order another drink and I want you gone by the time I get it. 